Tecla PowerFab can help streamline your material management processes, eliminate costly errors and increase material efficiency. Having imported a fabrication package from Tecla Structures into production control, my materials can be transferred onto a requisition and because it has come directly from the model, I know I'm only ordering exactly what I need. From here, I can perform a combine, which fundamentally does two things. Firstly, it checks what material I already have in inventory, whether this be offcuts from previous jobs or general stock material. This ensures that I use material I own first before buying new material. Secondly, it optimises the remaining parts into standard lengths that I can buy from my suppliers, creating an optimised shopping list with minimal waste. This list can then be sent as a request for pricing to my suppliers, either in Excel or a more traditional report format. The Excel file allows suppliers to digitally input their pricing information, which in turn can be re-imported back into the requisition to speed up the ordering process. Once I know which supplier or suppliers I wish to buy from, I can simply transfer the materials onto a purchase order. In this case, I will order my hollow sections from Pride Metals and everything else from SMG Steel. At this point, the material is deducted from the requisition, preventing me from ordering the same thing twice. As a result, two purchase orders have been created. From here, I can add any additional information, such as agreed delivery dates, before I produce a printed purchase order that I can email directly to my supplier. In the time between ordering the material and it being delivered, I can generate my cut lists so that when it does arrive, the workshop knows exactly what parts need to be cut from every bar and sheet, eliminating unnecessary downtime. At the point materials are being delivered, I can use EPM Go, Tecla PowerFab's mobile web app, to confirm what has been received. Using a tablet, I can enter critical traceability information, such as delivery note and heat number, as well as the laydown area. Spending a little time checking materials in at this stage prevents the inevitable delays caused when only discovering bars are missing when I come to cut them. The materials are now visible in Tecla PowerFab's inventory system, where I can also add associated material test certificates for compliance with my material traceability requirements. To complete the workflow, I can then use EPM Go to confirm when each bar and sheet has been cut. A digital version of the cutting list provides machine operators with a list of parts to be cut from each bar, along with the corresponding NC files and drawings. To mark a bar as being cut, I simply enter the relevant information, such as heat number used and details of any offcuts produced. Once confirmed, the bar turns green and the associated parts are marked as cut within Tecla PowerFab's fabrication tracking system. Finally, the same bar is automatically deducted from Tecla PowerFab's inventory, and if an offcut has been produced, this is automatically added, so it is available to use on the next job. Thank you for watching this short Tecla PowerFab video. For more information, please contact your local Trimble representative.